hi to Chaco. We love these Archmage and Footman. 1.6 so much. Live on that for the rest of your life. Yeah. You could invest it and you could just earn a lot of money or live on the money for a long time. This Footman gets perched. Do you see uh, some of the water elemental now? There it is. Wow. So predictable. And uh, he's killing the creeps, yeah. And we see the same over here. What item? Ring of protection plus two. Not really what he wanted, but it's uh, what he deserves. What is it? We have more. Oh, we have a second place, a third place as well. Tome of IQ over there. Maybe he wants to pick that up? Don't you want to be smart? Hello? Andrew Math? Don't you like to do math? If you want to do math, you have to be smart. Mantle of intelligence. You like your mantle, but not your tome. Okay, don't pick up the tome, man. Don't pick it up. We have a nice uh, circlet over here. I'm sure he picked up a tome. Oh, he, there he picks it up now. So 16, 18, 22. Here we have uh, 15, 18, 23. Which means that he, that uh, Blade got a tome of strength. Uh, also, he got the mantle of intelligence. So they both got the mantle of intelligence. Of course, a circlet much better than the rig of protection. You can invest it into Bitcoin and win millions later. Yeah, for example. Oh, he comes to Archmage with, uh, with the harass. He, of course, he scouted this with the footman. He knows, he knows Blade is creeping this. Uh, Blade does get the kill on the level six. He's almost level three already. He has a push of info as well. We will lose this footman. The Archmage killed him with a fireball. This footman does his retreat. Does get away. He doesn't want that to. Uh, he doesn't want to let it go away. So he kills it. Yeah, smart play by Blade. Footman takes a bit of damage. A player's forces are under attack. Okay. Oh, this water man. Can he deny it? Archmage, you need to deny it. Archmage! Archmage! 27? Oh, he's too late, isn't he? Oh, sh uh, did, was he too late? 390? I think he was too late. Yeah, yeah, he was too late. His footman is getting uh, stunned. <laughs> well, he was stunned forever. Stun locked by the three no uh, thunders, kobolds. There goes that one guy. The water elemental went down. This Archmage is almost level 3. He just needs 32 more XP. Footman retreating. Oh, this footman. Is he gonna kill the footman? No, the footman retreats. This footman. This footman. There's another water elemental here for Thor Zane. Hello, Chaco. Hello, Koopa the Quick. Welcome back. Conjurus Rex taking some damage. Uh, this would give him level 3. Does he get the kill? Let's see if he is going to get the kill. Or if he can uh, kill himself to the creeps. Yeah, he kills himself. This Archmage is pretty low on hit points. He has an info potion. He's, he gets level 3 somehow. What did he just kill? I didn't see him. Oh, here he, he's creeping with the militia. And he hits level 3. That extra hit points, those extra hit points are pretty good. This Archmage is in trouble. Why is he moving this way? Well, he's, uh, he's, uh, he has to TP now. So let's look at the tech. A bit, a lot faster tech for Thorzane. A lot faster. Blade likes to get us two Arcane Towers. Thorzane just likes to go one Arcane Tower. That's probably one of the reasons why his tech is so much faster. Archmage is level 3 against level 2. Wait, are the Archmages correct? It looks like it. Yeah. Beautiful overlay, Chaco. Thanks. So. Mount King. Do we get a Mount King here as well? Not yet, but... Well, not yet. This tech difference is pretty big. I wonder if uh, Thorsten can do something with it. Maybe a nice timing attack. Maybe a nice creep jack with storm bolt. Blades going for a four star shadow priest. He does pick up the belt of giant strength. He gets a berserker. This foot bat takes a lot of damage. He might get it back. Whoa. A nice tome of GT plus two. Whoa. Whoa. Does he not want it? He wants it. He reads the book. Nice book. Over here, Andrew Math is finally level three. Let's go for the Sasquatch now. Mount King, Bezel, Bloodstone. The footman, oh, maybe he will find Blade here. Does he see it? Does he, uh... Interesting, interesting. What's so interesting here? Did he not see him? If you're gonna scout from here, 
to here. You need to make sure you see someone that's creeping here, right? <laughs> you didn't see him. You just ran into him. But the TP out here by uh, by Blade. He didn't want to engage there. I don't know. He could have probably... Oh, he doesn't have a second hero yet. The Warking Sanctum going up. A player's forces are under attack. Kills the Sasquatch, but the item does it get here? Replenishment potion, not very good. Might as well sell it. Yeah, you just sell that item, right? Just sell it. Hello? Just, it's such a bad item. Come on. There it is. Nice sellage. Nice sellage. There's the Mount King. What level is the Mount King? Level 2. He's almost level 3, guys. Almost level 3. He has a nice mo potion of greater mana. Not sure if he needs to use it. I think so, yeah. In Spellbreaker against Spellbreaker fights, you actually need to use those Potion of Greater Mana because uh, Spellbreakers should drain the mana of the Mountain King. Hello, Endermath. He's an illusion. Don't be, f don't be fooled, guys. Poof. He's gone. Uh, this is a real Archmage, but because he just saw illusion, he probably shows this as an illusion as well. <laughs> But it was a real one, yeah. He doesn't have the Mountain King yet. Well, he has one now, but... So it's not like he could have just storm it and killed it. Here comes the militia. Can, uh... There's a but kills a footman. This guy, this Cobalt Taskmaster. Oh, the, uh, this Pawbreaker takes so much damage. storm there. I feel like Blade killed it. Yeah, 94 XP. 114 XP now on the Mountain King. Does he pick up the Tome of Agility? He picks it up. He's so much more agile now. 11 Agility on the Mountain King. This one has 14 though, but it's level 3 Mountain King. Hello. Level 3 Mountain King against level 1. But this Archmage is close to level 5. This one is just barely level 3. Wow. Wait, did he just kill something? He just killed something, didn't he? bunny or something i heard it i heard it die. there it is <laughs> mr bunny no. there's another water element the storm bolt on the footman he is going down fast he's dead guys Urgh. storm bolt on this footman oh this footman is also going to die of course every storm bolt is pretty much a dead footman there's another footman dying this footman is also dead militia helping out a lot Expansion is up here, by the way, for um, Thorzain. Stormbolt on the on the Mount King. This priest is he going to die? He dies. Mount King in the back is level two now. Water metal goes down. This Mount King may be Stormbolt surround. He has a lot of militia, but the uh, enter surround by the spellbreaker saves the Mount King. And he survives now. The militia now for uh, Thorzain as well in this fight. This spellbreaker is super low on hit points. Moves to the. Yeah, he escapes, but where does he go to next? We'll see. This Mount King is very low on hit points. A nice bash there. And he gives the info potion just in time from the Archmage to the Mount King. And he did uh, did see, I think, the expansion. Uh, Blade doesn't hasn't even crapped his expansion yet. These militia are waiting for the Mount King, maybe? That's uh, They're pretty eager, but that's pretty dangerous. Thorzen is trying to get a bomber footman here. This footman, is he uh, is he dead? Six hit points. <laughs> Stormbolt on a six hit point footman. Yeah, pretty overkill, but he does get the kill. This this peasant is blocking. Hello, kill this peasant first, and then this one if you want to kill them. But you don't have to kill them. They're just peasants. They're just innocent little people. They're not like warriors. They're not military. Just uh, civilians, really. Some more priests here. A dead priest here as well. Is anyone attacking? No. No. Is any, Does anyone have a zeppelin? No, right? No. Don't. Why don't they get zeppelins in human mirrors? feel like they do, right? But these players don't. Mountain King in the back got the Stormbolt. And he uh, gives the back a Stormbolt. All oh, the Mountain King's getting Stormbolted. This priest is... Still alive? Yeah. Water Metal gets dispelled and killed. Nice. Oh, he's creeping this with Militia. Actually, you're crap both of it already. Only two trolls left. It's 
gonna kill the trolls, build the expansion. Yeah, sounds good. Blacksmith going up. Here comes the arc base. He's almost level five. Plus nine IQ or plus eleven IQ with the circlet. Hello, he's so smart. Forty IQ on the arc base. Compare this to this arc base. Hey, there's a zeppelin just after I mentioned it. Uh, twenty nine IQ on this arc base. Yeah, uh, bye bye peasants. This tunnel is going to be cancelled. The peasants are going to be killed. Does he have a TP? He has a TP. Thor's in firmly in her lead. So what is uh, what's Blade gonna do? He's just gonna creep, you know? Get his Mountain King to level 5. Level 4, I guess. <laughs> two two belt of Giant Strengths. Archmage can't get XP anymore, so... Um, move him away before you kill any of these guys. That's what he does, you know? Perfect play. Thorsten just going for the main. Oh, Archmage realizes he doesn't have time to move away because his main is under attack. Okay, never mind. He does. Never mind. Okay, Django. Django, pretty good. Pretty good item. This illusion. Uh, what is this in my chat? Where's the ban button? Oh, there it is. There. Stormwall of the Footman. The Footman is going down, guys. He's dead. This militia in the front. Is he going down? He is, is, is he going to die? He does die. Spellbreakers are 0 0. The Spellbreakers here are also 0 0. The Spellbreaker, does he get the kill? Mountain King is now level 4. Ah. Ah. And a TP out by Thorzen. Wait, does. Do we still have a chance here for Blade to win the game? Uh, I can join for the next game. Nah, I'll do it to, uh, I'll do it by myself today. Solar cast, a beautiful solar cast. Besides, if uh, if Blade still manages to win this game somehow, we might just have only one more game after this. But actually, I don't think Blade is gonna win this. We'll see. We'll see. These uh, heroes are pretty strong for Blade, though. He has a much stronger hero. So he's only 20 supply behind. Maybe the heroes can make up the difference. Nice dispels there on the water metals. This spellbreaker is micro around, you know, beautifully. This spellbreaker is going to die. He's surrounded by priests. Not something you see that often. And, well, this, uh, this priest is very low on hit points. He goes down. <laughs> Militia helping out here for Thorzen as well. Can, what can Blade do? What can he do? Well, he can use the info potion. That's the start. And nice dispel there on the water elemental. So it's another water elemental. This priest is dead, guys. Roar. Well, maybe Blade should have just sent uh, like two pre uh, units over there. You know, two spellbreakers. He knows about the expansion, right? Wait, yeah. Does he? Wait, maybe he doesn't. I thought he, he does know about it. Now I'm not 100% sure anymore. Some water metals, the Zeppelins uh, can pick up whatever he wants. Mountain King, if he can get the Mountain King kill, he can make a comeback. No, Mountain King in the Zeppelin. Where is his Mountain King? He had mana for another Stormbolt. Uh, Archmage picked up beautifully. And dropped it back down in the back. Picks up a Spellbreaker. These water metals, do you have some dispels to throw in? No, now they're no, no longer close to each other. This priest picked up. Uh, some dispels. This priest is also dead. Stormbolt on this priest. Can he kill it? He is going to kill it. He's dead, guys. Mountain King in the back. The Archmage taking a lot of damage. He drops some uh, priests. Picks them back up. Picks the Archmage back up as well. This, uh, this Mountain King takes a lot of damage again. But he moves so fast with the Django. And he has so much strength with the two belts. But there is the GG. Okay, now it's GG. And the hero levels even. And I could even add uh, that you can see their XP. But I've been lazy, so you can't see that yet. I approve the streamer. Thanks. For getting your approval. A legend. Okay. I got approval of a legend. 
Play it again with his early farm. Ha! Kappa Kappa. <laughs> kappa Kappa. Do you build this early farm as well, Death Note? Right, because he's he's again he's uh, how much gold is he behind? Like sixty gold behind right now. Just to, to get his uh, peasant but er, a bit earlier. He gets a few. He gets the next peasant, of course, earlier as well. So he gets a lot of go a lumber back for it. Probably gets more. Last time I said ten lumber, but it's probably more than ten lumber. It's, uh, I don't know. How much lumber is that? Like what? 50 lumber? 60 lumber? Let's see. How much lumber does he have right now? So we have both. They use the same amount of lumber, right? And he's going to creep now. And he's going to creep now. So they use the same amount of lumber. He's, he's They have the same amount of peasants still on lumber. So Blade has only five more lumber. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Here's a footman. Here we have a footman as well. They're both creeping this. And over here, of course, they're creeping this. This Archman is killing this null overseer. <laughs> Claws of attack is what he picks up. Or does he pick it up? These militia, hello! Okay, he picks it up. Nice pick up there by Blade. Me over here. Archman's got a, you know, nice one as well. Circlet. Footman being so annoying. This footman is scouting over here. Okay. Thorzane doesn't like to be annoying with his footman. Like Blade. Uh, Blade is so annoying with his footman. Tower going up for Thorzane after tacking. He's already tacking. What about Blade? Blade's not tacking yet. He's first building the scout towers and arcane towers. So a very careful play by Blade. Maybe just knows. Like maybe knows. Like in the long run, I can beat Thorzane. I just play safe. I play a very safe style. I don't want to lose to an Archmage and a footman in my base, killing all my peasants. Oh, and uh, on the same time, because you have those Arcane Towers up, and you tag later, you can be much more aggressive yourself, but not if you get your Archmage surrounded. Hello. You just run into the, the surround. The footmen are here, going for a flank attack on the main, with the water elemental as well. This peasant here is, uh, is still alive. Let's go for this peasant over there. The Archmage, of course, is on his way again. This time without the TP. Footman in the back. This Archmage needs to defend against these evil footmen. This water metal could probably be in a better position there. Could have, like, for example, blocked this this hole. There goes uh, one footman. One footman then. Hey, hello, a Tome of Strength. Read it if you want to, or don't read it if you don't want to, because it's a boring book. Who wants to read a book about strength anyway? Uh, if you want strength, go to the gym, work out. You know, don't read a book about it. Peasant, the footman did kill two peasants. To work on another peasant, this peasant here he is taking a bit of damage. Can they get the kill? No. Oh, Archmage tries to block, and he does get a block on one footman after he let the other one slip through. Let's see, this footman is dead. This peasant is still alive. We, of course, have attack here for um, Blade as well. Archmage take some damage. Wallermantle surrounded by militia guys. Great. Thorzin owns TH. Thorzin killing a Murloc. Oh, I didn't check yet if the heroes are correct. Is one of these heroes almost level 3? Yes. Okay. So Thorzin's hero is going to hit level 3. Is this going to be enough? 25 XP? Yes, it's level 2. It should be enough. Car. Level 3. Is that Thorzen's hero? Yeah. Perfect. I, I've gotten so lucky in these uh, human mirrors. Forces are under attack. With the heroes. And there's Naga. Naga for Thorzen. Of course, uh, you know, the tech is much slower for Blade. He doesn't have a Naga. He doesn't have a second hero. He has, he has no nothing. There's Arcane Tower. He has another tower that can be upgraded to an Arcane Tower. Blade is below, uh, behind by 
for supply. He has a lot of money though, and he will reach tier 2 in a moment. Meanwhile, he's killing a dragon with his Archmage. Even though he's red, you'd think they'd be allies since both are red. That's not how it works in this game. There goes the Arcane Vault. It's dead, guys. Go for a farm, okay. What is this? A panda for blade. And what does he get here? He gets a nice Scourge Bone Chime. Oh, I guess it's alright early game when you still have the Footman and Militia. This Footman is... and the panda. This Footman going for this peasant. The Naga. Oh, he tries to surround the Naga, but... Oh, wait! What is the Naga doing? She's like, please surround me, please! And he gave, uh, you know, he gave the panda plenty of opportunities to surround her and he gets her eventually. So uh, he's eating some nice sashimi right now. The Archmage shows up, summons a water metal, the footman does retreat, the Naga is dead. So uh, this this farm is going down. So many water elementals, hello. And uh, Thorzane, of course, he's, uh, he's trying to kill this footman. What is he doing in his main? I want to check, but let me check right now. He's going to castle. Getting his Naga back, building priests. He's going for knights and priests. This Archmage and this uh, water metal hunting down this footman. Yeah, the footman, 72 hit points, 39 hit points, 5 hit points, can he kill himself? Uh, I was about to say no, but then they woke up and they attacked the peasant. And I think the, uh, the ogres did get a kill. I didn't expect them to just wake up there and kill the peasant. I was like, hey, he's not attacking the creeps, so they're gonna keep sleeping. Mm-hmm. Well, the panda's creeping here now. Archmage is here with Naga. Uh, Blade is staying at tier 2, by the way. So, he better win before there are knights and... priests And a third hero. He has to win before that. Or maybe go for an expo or something. Meanwhile, I have uh, Archmage creeping over here with the Naga. What item does he get? He gets a nice little gauntlet. Nice gauntlet. Is Ogre Magi, is he, uh, he's dead. What does he pick up here? Parry up. Yeah, some extra hit points. Yeah, yeah, Naga will take it. You over here, Archmage with two water metals. Doing a lot of damage to the barracks. The Panda wants level three. Picks up the Tome Strength. Now going for the Ogre Magi, kills that with a nice 66 critical strike there with the Pogo Stick. Sells whatever item he got. And uh, do we have an engagement here? 41 supply here for Blade. Thorzin at 33, he's going for this priest. The priest is taking a little bit of damage here with the first arrow. The priest, is he going to die? 69, 34, 16. And another shot. Oh, he survived, another heal. Five hit points now, and there, there he goes, he died. The of fire was used here by the panda. The Archmage takes care of the water elemental. Now he's going for the Naga. The Naga is shooting out the footman. This footman in trouble, guys. Can he kill the footman? Yeah, he kills the footman. And now he retreats. There's no Stormbolt here or no... I'm not even sure if he has Drunken Haze. So, but the nice block there on the Archmage. is nice. Oh, there's the Sorcerers. With the Sorcerers, he can catch them. Do we have a TP? We do have a TP. And with we, I mean Thorzane. Has a TP. Panda level 3. Archmage level 3. There's a paladin, there's a master priest, there's the workshop, there's the, you know, animal war training. He has four priests now, they're adept still, but soon they'll be masters. <laughs> the water mental is gone, nice breath of fire. Holy light on the naga. <laughs> The priest here, is he in trouble? We do have some dispels, he dispels uh, some water metals. The priest is dead. There goes the footman. Tome of Jitty on the floor, by the way. Kapling! Uh, just uh, let me uh, let me read it after this fight. We have a Tome Strength here on the floor. This footman, one footman goes down, the other footman also goes down. The Paladin. Paladin is uh, pretty long hit points. There's a flying machine for s scouting, I guess. It's kind of the uh, mortar team. 
And cancel on the shop. Okay, I guess there's not much of a fight. Uh, 24 FFA up if anyone wants to join in the fun while watching the kick-ass stream of pure ponage. Of, of, of ownage. 250 bits. Thanks, Croc Dog, for the uh, 250 bits. Thanks for the beautiful support. Hope uh, some people join your game. And you have some fun. This priest here is super long hit points. Take some more damage. Two info potions here on the panda. There's a spell breaker. Blade is going for the base here. They're shattering uh, fragmentation shard. Such a good upgrade. The mortar teams are gonna be so strong. Does he have any yet? No, he doesn't have any yet. Oh, he has one. Okay, he has one. And he's getting knights. He needs a bit more time and he's just creeping. He has one knight over here. He's gonna lose some buildings here. Repairing some buildings. He wants a hero level, though. He wants, uh, what does he want exactly? Level 4 Archmage, that's what he wants. And he has Flood of Accuracy, that's what he wants. Deep is home, and uh, what can Blade do? Blade can go for the farm. He's going for the farm. Uh, the upgrade is done though. The shard upgrade, fragmentation shard upgrade is done. These mortar teams now do so much damage against spellbreakers, against priests. Against anything, really. The footman is dead. Ooh. Hi, guys. Hi, Chaco. Hello, Poggy underscore DE. A player's forces are under attack. Don't read it. I didn't mean it for that. Okay. <laughs> I just now read that you wrote that, but whatever. We have uh, the Naga killing some Murlocs. This Murloc is dead. Tom of IQ here on the floor. Does he pick it up? Does uh, Naga, Naga does pick it up? Shockwave hits like a few priests. Uh, this is uh, Water Elemental. Four hit points. And he kills it. The, the guy went down. The mortar team went down. Guess human mirror is a cure for insomnia. Maybe, maybe it works. I don't know. I'll give it a try uh, tonight. It is a pretty good game, though. Thursday is staying at fifty supply. Well, Blade went over fifty. Thorsten has much higher income right now. He can build. Uh, well, he can't build anything if he wants to stay under fifty. But he's gonna collect some money, and then later he can. Build a lot, a big unit at once, big four army at once, with the knights and the mortar teams and more priests, etc. Because he will have a lot of gold. But uh, there's a panda. Breath of fire harass on the peasants, and then end the buildings, of course. Mods are exempt from night build terrain. Well, so are the uh, subs, by the way. Look at Blade Base. Tier 2 or Tier 3 Griffins, maybe? Oh, Blade went to Tier 3. Hello, Chaco. Good thing you're paying attention to chat, because chat pays attention to the game. <laughs> that's, that's how I pay attention. That's how you become a professional streamer. You just read chat, and they tell you what to pay attention to. We have an Archmage now, plus 18 damage. We don't have griffins now, we just have uh, animal war training and a workshop going up. Oh, look at this bloodless sorceress. She takes uh, some damage, but the holy light. Nice breath of fire here by the panda. These knights are zero zero, these power breakers are zero zero. Nice zero zeros. 56 against 57. It seems like Thor Thor's aim went over 50, and he's fighting all right. He's He wants to win before, before the tier 3 ticks in for a blade. There goes a priest. He's totally dead. This priest is also dying. Nice block here with the knight. Rawr! Can he get the paladin? Oh, man, you have health there. Man, you have health. The paladin attacks with his hammer, doing so much damage. A nice 27 to 20, uh, 37 damage. There again. This 
Paladin doesn't like to take that much damage. There's the first mortar team. I don't think he has the shards yet. Fragmentation shards. He's getting his knights as well. And militia helping out as well. The fork lining does so much damage to the militia. Hello. And uh, a nice mortar team attack helping as well. All these. Oh, wow. The priest just exploded. This uh, surge takes some damage. The Paladin also died somewhere. And we have a more attacks here of the mortar teams. And they just do so much damage. We have a heal scroll. We have one heal scroll. But it's then not going to be enough, is it? Uh, he doesn't even use it yet. Does he use it uh, maybe now? Yeah, he uses it now. 120 critical strike by the panda. Panda make, can make the comeback with those crits, of course. There's a breath of fire. Uh, the knight gets staffed out. Do we see some more crits here by the Mr. Panda? No. But all these units are so dead. Hello, these mortar teams do way too much damage. Nice uh, mortar team attack there by Blade. On these priests here in the back. And the panda and... Oh, breath of fire. There, one of them did die. The mortar team went down as well, though. And Blade is quite far behind. 12 supply behind. He's getting mortar teams for himself now. More mortar teams. More tar teams. Thor's a strong player. Very strong. How many subs do you have? I don't know. Like, probably around 60. Archmage here does plus 18 damage. A player's forces are under attack. Oh! Berserker is going to die. Did he get an item here? Or was the item already crapped? I think it was already uh you already had it earlier, right? This close of attack plus twelve. Oh it's no it's not a lot crap yet, hello! It's still there. Archmage is so big when he's bloodlusted. Who well, is gonna get the Ogre Lord? It seems like Thorzane wants it, but Blade also wants it. So they both want the same thing, but we only have one of them. One Ogre Lord available. Taco flavored keysies. Thanks, Pink Glitterbug, for uh, for subscribing. Welcome to Chaco Bell. And um, yeah, thanks for the beautiful support. Let me give you some taco flavored keysies. There. Those are for you. Hope you enjoy them. More the teams just attacking and stuff. It's a beautiful game, this game. Oh, we have an expansion going up for Thorzane. Surprise! Surprise. That's, of course, why those militia killed the first soul berserker there. We have inner fire on these mortar teams. They do so much damage because they also have the flute of accuracy. So, plus 12 damage, but he uh, stole the inner fire. So, now they do just do plus 6 damage. These mortar teams in the back, you know, beautiful. Blade is up in supply again. And uh, just a second, uh, Living Cohen. This, this panda, is he trapped? He's trapped, but he has the info potion. He used the info potion. More mortar. Oh, look at these mortar shots just doing so much damage. It's so insane. Oh, but the counter mortar shots kill so much. Hello, the priests are so dead. And the knight goes down. The panda, he wants his uh, mortar teams. Does he use a breath of fire there? The archmage is even just walking past some knights just to get to the mortar teams. He gets a holy light. These mortar teams are also going for the mortar teams. Everyone's going... These knights are probably just... Okay. He's going for the mortar teams. It seems that's all I'm saying the last few seconds. This mortar team is uh, is dead. He just lost two mortar teams in the in the span of two seconds. This mortar team is takes a holy light. These two... Uh, you know, it goes down. He's back to one mortar team. But the Naga, is she going to be just fine? She gets staffed out. And there's another attack by the mortar team on the Archmage. His ma uh, the Paladin is pretty low on hit points. Uh, does he have the Divine Shield or... No, he doesn't have the mana. He has, gives the TP to the Paladin and TPs out. And... Uh, well, Blade the 50 supply. Thorzin at 56. And Thorzin has expansion up. Thanks, Living Koan, for the subscription. Welcome back to uh, Chaco Bell. Here are your taco flavored keysies. Hope you enjoyed the... Uh, like them hope you enjoy uh, come on Chaco hope you like them hope you like them <laughs> living Cohen <laughs> and uh, thanks for a beautiful support
Cohen and I were planning this from the start, subbing together, because we live together. I fucking love Taco Bell. Very delicious cast. Are under you can taste my casts. That's how good they are. The Archmage is almost level 5. Over here we have uh, an Archmage who is almost level 5. The Panda here is almost level 5. And the Paladin is level 2. Here we have a Naga who is level almost level 4. And a Paladin who is level 3. Hello. What item did he get by the way? I wasn't paying attention. Another Claws of Attack plus 12? Yeah. So he has two Claws of Attack plus 12, a Claws of Attack plus 9 and a Claws of Attack plus 6. In total plus 39 damage on this Archmage. Is, is that pretty decent? Is that decent damage? Or are you saying like I want more damage? I, I want Inner Fire. Well, if if you get inner fire, you can. Oh, he does have an inner fire. He can steal inner fire from his opponent for more damage on that arc mage. Here we have a flute of accuracy. Maybe if he gives that to uh, Blade, it's gonna be nice. Uh, of course, the barracks went down. The workshop went down. This Naga takes a bit of damage from this arc mage that does put 39 damage. Hello, Paladin retreats a little bit with the uh, divine shield being cast. Naga survives, of course. Holy Light saves her. This unit is uh, being hunted down by the knights. These spellbreakers hunting down these casters. Where is the blue? Uh, I mean, the red Archmage. Oh, here he is. It Let's see what he's killing. Oh, the sorcerers go down. This mortar team takes a lot of damage. These two priests also taking a lot of damage. These knights are just so fast. And they, uh, they kill all these units so efficiently. The Mountain King is not here. There's a paladin uh, used heals for or something. He's healed. He'd use the Divine Shield, this Archmage with the Inner Fire now, plus 43 damage, but uh, if you're not attacking, it doesn't matter. The Knight's blocking, the Knight's trying to kill the Archmage, this is another Holy Light, now the Paladin is too far away. Archmage survives 6 hit points, thanks to that Inner Fire that he stole from his opponent. Hello, this Paladin, also, uh, you know, walking over there. It seems it's pretty difficult for Blade at this point, hello. Did I say hello already? I think I said hello already, but... Uh, we have an expansion up here for Thorzane. Oh, Blade's going for the counter expansion. And Thorzane is up by so much supply and he kills another uh, guy, another mortar team. This priest just explodes. He just doesn't want to see life the way anymore like he saw before. This knight going for the Archmage right in his face. Just attacks him right in his face with the sword. The Archmage attacks back with 39 damage, but it's not enough damage. Holy Light on the Archmage. If only the Archmage did more damage. If only he did more damage, maybe Blade would have a good chance here. Maybe uh, we need to have the damage of the Archmage buffed. Send the letter, letter to Blizzard, send them this replay. Be like, yeah, Archmage doesn't do enough damage. Better than Holy Lights the Archmage. Mr. Mortar Team here takes a lot of damage. Mr. Spellbreaker dies. The Water Elementals will go down. So much XP here. He's even blocking these priests here with the knight, or I'm not sure if that was on purpose or just, uh... No, this is on purpose. Yeah, he's blocking the priests with the knights. The knights are 1-0. Very deliberately microed. And GG by Blade! And that means we have a 2-1 advantage for Thorzai and he's making the comeback, guys. We have an Archmage here, we have some uh, footmen here. <laughs> hey, there's an Archmage for Blade. Hey, there's an uh, Archmage for Thorzen. That's nice. That's nice. Blade's gonna creep over here. Archmage here, go for the Murlocs. This Murgle Tide Warrior is is gone. He's, he's he's dead. His family is pretty sad, but they're kind of busy right now, so they don't have really time to mourn. Uh, they're being killed themselves. Yeah, this guy, he's dead. This guy, now he looks like everyone. And uh, he's also dead. Level 1 Shell Light Binder, 144 XP. Here we have uh, a Landazer, he's level 2, 225 XP. And he's going for the next creep camp, very smart. Do we see an expansion at any point? Because he did creep this very early, but it doesn't look like he's going for an expansion. These sea giants, they look strong and powerful, they're weak guys, they're spaghetti. Don't be scared of a sea giant, just because it's big doesn't mean it's strong. Footman. What a food man. Stream plus pizza. Oh, that sounds pretty good. What's the name of this map? This is the Green Kennel. And the Archmage is sleeping because this Dark Troll High Priest, he has sleep. And uh, that's why the Archmage fell asleep. Here goes Thorzane though with a nice creep jack. 
Archmage has Sentry Wards, but he didn't place anyone. Uh, yet, no, no Sentry Wards placed yet. The Footman is dead. Do we see the pickup of the Rune of the Watcher? Can you kill this? I wonder. I think you can, right? But he doesn't kill it. This Footman does retreat. What is this? The Ring of Protection. No one picks it up. There goes a Peasant. Nice kill by Shell Lightbinder. And these Peasants, they do retreat. The Archmage picks up the items here for Blade. The Ring of Protection. He has two of them now. So much protection. Seven armor. The Archmage wants a Peasant. He wants to kill it. He's shooting it with fireballs is a militia now and does he die he doesn't die he, he's going for a different peasant now he kills a different peasant archmage has to retreat there's no boots on this archmage so the archmage will get away this, this footman kills a peasant this footman very low on hit points and he will get out of this base no problem whatsoever for this footman to get out of this base that was easy why do you have a gold mine as your background <laughs> It's a subliminal message to my viewers. Kappa. Oh, it's a fountain of mana, by the way. This is a random one. Sometimes fountain of mana. Sometimes the fountain of health. Well, to, right now it's fountain of mana. Look at this guy. He has frost armor. That's nice. Oh, he do did buy the boots here. Thorzen did. This Archmage, he used the Sentry Wards. Places one over here. And one over here. There's a little crab over there. The bottom metal. Fighting against the prawns. What about the tech? So every time, Blade has been much slower. Again, he's much slower attacking. There's a Mount King already here for Thorzen. Uh, probably tier 2 will go up soon. And, you know, he's walking around the map. He's just healing. Healing while walking. Hello, Mr. Chaco. Hello, Mr. Uh, Dima TV. Hello. And now the water elemental is sleeping. I didn't know water elemental slept even. I didn't know this because normally they don't sleep. And uh, yeah, that's nice. He's a pick up the, he picks up the watcher word. He sees so much. Blade, he has two sentry words and two watcher words on the map. He sees like the entire map. These footmen are beautiful. He does get away with the footman. This footman does retreat the archmage here. What a beautiful hero. He's going for this footman. He's doing a lot of damage to the footman. Archmage blocks the archmage. Archmage. With the boots of speed, of course. It's uh, pretty easy. Oh, but the archmage gets past. Can he get the kill? No. He, yeah, maybe. It depends. If he really wants it. He, well, he really, really wants it. So he's going for it. Meanwhile, this water metal did get surrounded. And, oh, he doesn't really, really want it. He just kind of wanted it. So the footman does get away. Is he trying to surround this guy? He wants it. A player's forces are under attack. Player's forces are under attack. So, uh, Double Arcane Sanctum is up. He's getting priest. He built a farm there. That's beautiful. This Mount King is out. Blade has, of course, a Mount King as well. He's also building double Arcane Sanctum. No castles this game. Archmage attacks the footman. He's still alive. Oh, the Archmage in trouble. Dodges the Stormbolt with the TP. That was very close, by the way. He TP'd like at the last moment. But now uh, Blade can creep this. He can creep this. Like, easy peasy. And he can see when uh, when Thorzen is coming with the Sentry Ward. The Archmage is still only level 2 for Thorzen. Wait, are, are the heroes correct? Yeah. Those are correct. At least the Archmages are. Don't know about the Mountain Kings yet. He's killing his, killing his own water elemental since he's bored. He has to wait for his tree to be cut anyway because he's stuck in his base. Very nice play here by Thorzen. You'd think like maybe he could fit through there. You know, if he, he gets off his horse, maybe, you know, he could. But the Archmage, he's too lazy, man. He doesn't want to leave his horse. He doesn't want to unmount his horse. Walk, hello, what is walking? Archmages don't walk, they just ride horses. There's Archmage over here. Going for this Murloc camp. There's a level 7 Murloc Shadow Caster. A Murgle Shadow Caster is a Murloc. He's level 7. He does chaos damage, that's right. And range chaos damage. He's taking the footman. You really should be attacking the heroes. Like, if you have range chaos damage, I would just right click these heroes for days. But uh, this Murloc is not that smart. So he goes, uh, he slowly goes down. It's nice. 
Car. Oh, wait, let me see what item he got. Uh, Legion Doomhorn. Eh. I mean, not Legion Doomhorn. Uh, Lionhorn of Stormwind. Meh. You know, Devotion Aura. Not that amazing. Not amazing. Catcar's Pipe. Oh, even worse. Meh. Huh. Let's see what we get over here. Car. Scourge Bone Chimes. Meh. Not amazing. I'm not sure if there's an amazing item here. Well, if you go mass spellbreakers against mass spellbreakers, of course the flute of accuracy is really amazing. A player's forces are under attack. Uh, rope of the Magi, though. Or belt of giant strength. Could be good. Here comes the archmage. Some a water elemental. Go for this peasant. This peasant is going down fast. Archmage is now level four. Land laser level four. Archmage. We have uh, Bandit, Forge Fire, level 3 Mountain King. Blade just killing more. Thorzani over here. Level 3 Archmage. Level 3 Mountain King. TP to the main, of course. He gets a Crystal Ball. Also another good... Oh, he, he, TP is not to the main, to the expansion, of course. And uh, the Spellbreaker, just uh, saying hello. Hello. Blade has a lot of gold. What is he using it for? Upgrades? Yeah, upgrades. Footmen are 1 0. There, 1 0. These footmen are 0 0. Yeah. Is he getting upgrades? Not yet, right? He doesn't have a blacksmith now. Blade forces are under attack. Archmage is just killing a bunch of Hydras. Look at this. Mountain King, hello, plus 7 armor, 11 armor, 39%. Three beautiful rings here. This is so beautiful, guys. So beautiful. And the Gloves of Haste means that he can bash a bit more often. Potion of Greater Mana, useful in this matchup as well. Markman is uh, walking in head first. This Mountain King only has two rings of protection. Ha! Huh. There's nothing. Seven armor total. This one has 11 armor total. Hello. Oh, here comes Blade. He knows he knows he has to win right now. Since he didn't uh, counter expo. Mountain King retreats a little bit. Footman just killing peasants. Very smart play here by Blade. Just have two footmen kill the peasants and just you know fight it out. It's by time for these footmen to kill everything. There goes a the footman of uh, Thorzen. This footman of Blade is also going to die. I will uh, read it after the game. The footman is dead or after the fight. This, uh, this footman is also going to die. And, you know, this footman, is he going to survive? Yeah, easy peasy. The Mountain King takes so much damage. Uh, the Mountain King, can he kill the Mountain King? The Mountain King Stormbolt's a peasant and then survives. He has one more Stormbolt pretty soon. This Mountain King has plenty more Stormbolts. He still has a greater mana potion. But he's uh, being drained by the Spellbreakers. Does he Stormbolt the Mountain King? Is he going for the Mountain King? He's going for the Mountain King. Can he kill the Mountain King? The Archmage doesn't do plus 39 damage this game. The uh, Mountain King does TP out. This priest dies. All the peasants have been killed by the two footmen. Is he going for the expansion? Or is he going to push forward? Is he trying to kill the Mountain King? But he can now buy healing potions. That's what he does. He buys a healing potion. And Blade 61 supply. Or saying 60 supply. And does he retreat? 1-1 one, one spellbreakers, by the way. Against 0-0 zero, zero spellbreakers. These peasants, you know, there's... Hello? Okay, let me read that. Uh, let me read that. Meow. Meow. Danner donated 5 euro. Thanks, Danner, for the beautiful support. Uh, thanks for all your efforts and work with 3 Chaco. No. No, Danner. Thank you. Thank you. And you're welcome. Stormbolt on this peasant. He's dead. This peasant also dead. Arr! These militia. Maybe they want to continue working here. And that's what they're doing. Okay, he has six peasants now. But here comes Blade. Oh, Archmage, hello! No TP, no nothing! Can he get the surround off in time? No. Evil potion used here by the Mount King. 
He wants his arc base. Another storm ball. Does he get the kill? No. No, wait. Why? why? Oh, no. All he needed was one shot with the Archmage and he would have been dead. Come on. The Archmage is level 5 for Blade now. 61 supply against 61. Down is under siege by the water elemental, but he should be going uh, for the peasants. It's Archmage low on hit points, it's Mountain King low on hit points, this Stormbolt. Low on range. I mean, you know, pretty, uh, pretty far away. Archmage and the Mountain King hiding from this Mountain King. Nice bashes here on these spellbreakers. It doesn't look good for Thorzane. What can he do here? He has two footmen over there. And a Stormbolt on the priest. Maybe he was expecting uh, a counter expansion for Blade, but there's no counter expansion. So what are mentals uh, fighting against militias? Do we see Stormbolt? No. Nice bash. Uh, Stormbolt on the Mountain King. Can he get a counter kill on this or a counter? Can he kill this Mountain King? Can Thorzane? Thorzane probably needs a hero kill. Because if he doesn't, he's probably going to lose. Probably. Oh, his spellbreaker is very low on hit points. Uh, he cannot defend this expansion. If he could just do something. Like, no. Okay. GG. It's best of five. It's 2-2. Two -two. It's match point. The winner will win this tournament. And they win so many rebels. They win so many rebels. How many, how many rebels? I forgot how much. Uh, no, I remember. I remember. 1.6k rebels for the winner. 1.6k. Yeah, that's a lot of rebels. 1600 rebels. You can, uh, if that sounds like more to you, let's say 1600 rebels. So many rebels here. Of course, we're going Archmage first. Of course, Archmage for Thorzane as well. Both players with the Archmage. Seen some really good games on this map. Yeah, hopefully, this will be a really good game. 1.6k. Don't spend it on one place. Well, maybe if you go, go to a pancake restaurant, you will spend it all in one place. Because pancakes, they uh, can be pretty expensive. But, I mean, if you spend 1600 rubles on pancakes, you're going to be pretty happy anyway. Because you have some pretty good pancakes, yeah. Oh, I want to eat some pancakes. You can buy a month of World of Warcraft. Wow. You can buy a Mars bar at least. A player's <laughs> you can buy more than a Mars bar. <laughs> There's a uh, water elemental. He's going for this Ice Troll Trapper. And uh, he's killing these others as well. Nice ring of protection here. Here comes a footman. I want to eat pancakes now too. We should just do a stream where everyone eats pancakes. Just, you know, maybe watch a Warcraft and Warcraft and pancakes. What about that? That's what we name it. Warcraft and pancakes Wednesday or something, or Warcraft and Pancakes uh, Warcraft and pancakes Thursday. No brute going down to the Archmage, of course. This Archmage here creeping over here for Thorzen. This Ice Troll Warlord is dead. There's a wand of mana ceiling on the floor and of course a gauntlet. Pancake Cup. <laughs> the Hydro Chaco Pancake Cup. Warcraft plus Waffles? Warcraftles? I mean, we can uh, introduce other foods as well, of course. We can have Pancake Day one day, then we can have waffles the, the other day and then we can have like uh, broccoli broccoli warcraft some other day the art is creeping over here wafflecraft yeah because this guy picks up the gauntlet and the potion of greater mana pretty good what is this art is doing over here he's killing this ogre Arr, picks up the items going for the first tool ice tool Archmage almost level 3. This Archmage is almost level 3. Uh, what about the tech? So every time Thorzane is tacking faster? 
that's again the case much faster look no tech yet for blade Thor's in already like 70% way uh, on his way to the tier 2 blade got a berserker so and the trolls and the everything and more footman blade is four supply up but is tech hello okay he's stacking now he's stacking now do you think pancakes or waffles waffles give you edge in worker 3 uh, waffles of course because waffles have a lot of edges and there's no not that many edges on the pancake just like one big round edge but waffles you know almost unlimited amount of edges this archmage attacks this footman a little bit nice block here by this footman by thorzane this archmage level three with the boots this archmage level three no boots this archmage attacks the footman nice block here with the footman maybe yeah players forces are under There goes the footman. This footman is dead, guys. And this water metal. You know, he's killing uh, this peasant. And the peasant is dead. Water metal is dead as well. And does he get another one? Yes, he will get another one. No! The Dispel here! The Forest of Shadow Priest just dispelled the Water Elemental. I didn't expect that because I didn't know the Troll was over there. I didn't realize he was over there. He may, maybe he just bought him. Uh, this one, yeah, he just bought a new one. And now, Blade is going for the base of Thorzane. Thorzane is getting a Mountain King. He's getting an Arcane Sanctum. He's staffing to his Peasant. And he has a Footman over there. Archmage attacks the Footman. The Footman with the Pant. These guys are attacking themselves. And the footman, is he going to die? The footman is dead. This uh, mannequin will show up though. Blade has so many trolls. There's three trolls or just two? I don't know. Here we have two trolls here for Thorzain. One Forest of Shadow Priest and one Berserker. Uh, this uh, footman, is he gonna survive? The footman survives for now. Archmage retreats. Okay, just two, I think. I mean, for, no, he does have three. Forestal Shadow Priest is what I meant. Of course, he also has a Forestal Berserker on top of that. The Archmage, he has boots. He's almost level four. Chaco, you want to marry me? Um, no. <laughs> no. Can you make waffles? Maybe if you can make waffles. Archmage level 3 and Mountain King level 1. He has Claws of Attack. Claws of Attack would be nice for the Archmage. Is Archmage level 4? Where is the second hero? Oh, there he is. He's still in the in the altar. Arcane Sanctum's going up. Here we have Arcane Sanctum's already up. A long time already. And uh, yeah, played 37 supply. What a game, guys. <laughs> Chaco's selling out for waffles. <laughs> Sure, please marry me. <laughs> well, I guess if you can make waffles, it's uh, time to get married. Man, imagine if if you were married to someone that just makes you waffles every morning. And you just eat waffles every morning. This sept in a really nice color with the water. You see the water and the snow, like blue and white. Like the zeppelin, I mean, it's not really white, but it's like, it's you know, wooden, uh, wood color, uh, wood color and uh, blue. You know, it's nice uh, color combination. It's pretty nice. Oh, Storbolt on the berserker. This berserker picked up by the zeppelin. Of course, he will cancel this town hall. He cancels the town hall. There goes one first of shadow priest. This next set first of shadow priest also dead. This first of shadow priest is stunned, so he dies as well. Three first of shadow priest dead. Wow, that is quite expensive. That's like 600 gold, and he's creeping me well with the mountain king and militia and priest. He's gonna expand himself. Uh, this berserker is gonna be killed by the footman and the archmage. He's dead. Rawr! This footman is also dead, and he picks up the other one with the zeppelin, sneaky zeppelin over there. And I mean, this water metal is surrounded. He did get rid of the tower. Archmage is right clicking the first soul shadow priest. Stormbolt on Archmage, but he should be able to get away as long as he doesn't get bashed. Wait, what is he doing? He's still trying to kill this guy. Okay. 
He's, he gets the kill, probably with the Berserker there, I believe, not with the Archmage. The Archmage was about to attack, but uh, it seems like uh, his staff, you know, was a dud. He just went through the animation, but no fireball came out. And, uh, what's this? A ring of protection. The water looks like Sea of Thieves. Yeah, over here you see like the waves and stuff. I still have to show you guys some fish. I think some of you uh, might think I made up the fish, but we do have fish in Warcraft 3, guys. I'm... Someday I will find them and I will show you guys fish. I just don't know where on the maps they are. I see the mountain creeping. I'm not sure if you can see the fish uh, in the fog of war anyway. So Thor's hands, tier 2. Plate stays at tier 2. Of course they stay at tier 2. They're going for these expansions. Ring of protection. This one's going up as well. Blade at 43. Thor's hands, 48 supply. This Mountain King is almost level 3, by the way. Almost level 3. This Mountain King just gets mana stone. And he has a mana potion as well. This one also has a mana stone. Okay, here comes uh, the creep jack. But there is... I mean... He, does he have a zeppelin still? Oh, there he is. He could always buy a new one. This berserker is dead. Stormbolt and just some focus fire and you kill a berserker. The Archmage is standing in the back here. He's almost level 5. One of the mountain kings is level 3. That is Thor's and mountain king actually. So the mountain kings are actually incorrect. Let me just fix it real fast. Sneaky fixing here by me. There. Now the correct Mount King is level 3. Actually, they're both level 3 now. Uh, Priest went down. And, uh, well, this Water Metal could be... Did this spell die Stormbolt on the Mount King? Can he get the kill? Can he get the kill? Stormbolt, no. Gave the TP to the Mount King. He just TPs out. Once uh, Spirit uh, Priest goes down. And these Priests are retreating. What a game, guys. Who has the level 5 Archmage Blade? Okay, so the blades are wrong. Uh, the Archmages are wrong as well. I might have sneezed here. Oh no, Blade is on the right side. Wait, Blade's on the right side? Did I do the Mountain Kings wrong then? Wait, the Mountain King? 588. Oh no, the Mountain Kings were correct. Okay, never mind. Never mind, I moved the Mountain Kings back. Blade has a Mountain King 729. And he has an Archmage, who's level 5, against level 4 Archmage. Okay, okay, beautiful. My overlay is actually uh, super duper beautiful. A player's forces are under Here comes the Archmage. Here comes the Archmage, he's invisible. Here comes the Archmage, he's visible. So it's a Water Elemental, level 3 Water Elemental. But there's some defense, the defense force right over here. Dispel available. Over here, Water Elemental, no defense force though. The Mountain King over here. Cloths of haste. Imagine if he could pick this up, but he's full on items. He would attack so fast, so many bashes, it would be insane. Anything would get stun locked. The Archmage here with the water metal just killing peasants. A player's forces are under attack. He, he leaves another item behind. I'm not sure what that was. Here's the Archmage. He's retreating or he's uh, defending against this level 4 Archmage. He's almost level 5. This Archmage is level 5. Luke will make it, makes it to a tier 3 uh, first. I'll look at it in a second. Okay, let's see. No attack. No attack. Okay. Water Elementals do get dispelled. Thor's Zane. Killing some gnolls. <laughs> Close of attack plus 6. Mount King with so much strength as well. Hey, did he just pick up the items? No. Or, or did he with the Archmage and the staff back to his ar uh, army? I think that's actually what he did. He did pick up the items. Here comes the Archmage. He's level 5. Some of water elemental. 67 supply for blade. 64 for uh, Thorzane. This arcane tower is going down. Archmage loses some mana. 
And uh, we have a beautiful fight here. 67 against 65. They both are uh, similar hero levels, similar army, similar, uh, you know, everything. But we have a Zeppelin for Thorzane. No Zeppelin for Blade. But if he wants one, he could buy one. If he really wants one. This, uh, this Spellbreaker is picked up. No, not picked up by the Zeppelin because the Zeppelin was too slow. There goes the uh, Thorzane Spellbreaker. We have two footmen here, by the way, alive with the fan, killing a priest. You should probably just kill the footmen. They do a lot of damage to your spellbreakers. And you can just kill them with a storm bolt. And uh, he storm bolts the, the mountain king instead. So Blade still has two footmen here doing so much damage. There's a storm bolt on this uh, mountain king. But he used the info potion to... Uh, oh, this mountain king in trouble now for uh, Blade. Oh, he does have a zeppelin. He does pick up the mountain king. And he drops it again so he can storm bolt something. Mountain king. Oh, storm bolt on the footman. Okay. Blade down to 50 supply, Thorstein 63 supply, Blade is under 50, he gets so much income right now, doesn't have to pay taxes. Like me. A player's forces are under attack. And, uh, yeah, great game. Is there someone attacking? No, no one's attacking. No one's attacking, guys. Car. Car, car. These spellbreakers are quite beautiful. They're one and zero now for Blade. These spellbreakers, one and one for Thorzane. This is a very exciting match. Blade is now 10 supply behind. Here comes Thorzane. Is he doing something fishy? Yes, he's building a farm all the way near the back of his base. Fireball attack on the spellbreaker. We have two zeppelins now for Thorzane. One is very low on hit points, so he's like, okay, I might as well buy another one. Instead of repairing the one, I mean, two zeppelins is better than one anyway, right? Yeah, yeah. 75 supply for Thorzane and two zeppelins. He seems very far ahead. Very, very far. But is he far enough ahead to win this game? He has the same upgrades now. 1-1 one, one against 1-1. One, one. Still no... Oh, castle! Blade is going to castle, castle and uh, workshop. Blade just needs to buy some time. Maybe he needs to attack this base instead, but it's too late now, I guess. But he needed to buy time. If this is what he's doing, he shouldn't just go, go ahead and fight straight on. Spellbreaker Chan in trouble. Is he going to die? He, he dies. The priest also died. For uh, Thorzane, this priest dies. For Thorzane, Spellbreaker was a Jebate or something. He picked it back up with his uh, Zeppelin and dropped it in the back somewhere. Units are dying. This priest is dead. This Spellbreaker is uh, pretty low on hit points. The Archmage and the oh, and he's dead, guys. This priest is still uh, oh, he's also dead. Spellbreaker is Michael back. Mount King Stormbolts on the Archmage. The Archmage is gonna get the Archmage? No, right? No, he has a TP. He has a TP, but at least he forces the TP, which is good, right? Although he lost all his peasants, so it's still not that great for Blade. But uh, at least he's not dead yet. I think now uh, it's time for some guerrilla tactics here for Blade. He is 20 supply behind and he has to get these castle units up. There's no castle for Thorzane. Okay, oh, there's some zeppelins uh, left behind. But uh, taking out the Zeppelins actually gives gives Thorzen just the time to, you know, knock back on his doorstep, knock on the door. And there's no no time for guerrilla tactics for Blade. He would just have to f fight again. Although there's no Zeppelins, sure. No Zeppelins for Thorzen unless he sneakily bought another one while well, I was not looking. He has a spellbreaker over there, nice. Um, yeah, Mountain King gets, uh, takes the Stormbolt, but he surrounds the Mountain King of Thorzane. He has the Info Potion, but if he gets Stormbolted, does he, does he pretend to throw a Stormbolt? No. Here is the Info Potion. The Spellbreaker's hold position, of course, we have a Zeppelin there for, uh, Mr. Blade. Uh, Mountain King gets out of the surround, gets Stormbolted, but i I think he's just gonna survive, hello. Stormbolt on the Mountain King of Blade, he's dead. Archmage level 6 for Thorzane, and Blade left the game voluntarily. 
GG, guys. GG. Easy game for Thursday. An easy game.